where the ANC is involved, you must listen to them three times. What do you mean? Can you repeat that? Because there are criminals who could be saying this and meaning something else. When you work with the ANC, you must always be awake. Otherwise, you'll read about yourself in the papers and you'll be shocked that is that me. Because they will make you do wrong things. Because you are thinking we are nice, nice, we are together. We are not together with the ANC. We are leading that municipality because the people of Etequini have elected us. No one is doing us a favor. How can Kaunda do us a favor? Before Kaunda does us a favor, he must go and do himself a favor with his music, failed music career. He tried to sing Gom. Linda Svia tried to boost him. It dismally failed because there is no talent at that level. So you must never look at Kaunda and think, this guy has done us a favor. Unlike other municipalities, we are in that executive because of the votes we got. Not because anyone invited us. Even if they don't like us, we'll still be in the executive. We may not hold a powerful department, but executive we are sitting. Why? The people of Etequini said so. But some of, some of you you are getting confused. You are thinking. And even when they say to you, ha, ah, you are working with the ANC. Ah, you start believing it. Okay. When we, work, when we don't work with the ANC, why do we have a person in the executive? It's not true. No one has given us that position. It is the voters who gave us that position. Comrades, we must make sure that the IFP in all municipalities where it governs we guard it properly. Because IFP, everywhere where it governs, there is financial mismanagement and there are sexual scandals. They, in every municipality governed by the IFP, they don't hire people through qualification. They use tribalism and they use sexual favors. That is the policy of the IFP. Every time you see IFP mayor and IFP leader, we must make sure that the IFP, which is suffering from paranoia, does not hire lots and lots of bodyguards for themselves at the expense of our municipalities. Because they are so obsessed with bodyguards. If there is a threat, let there be a driver and a bodyguard. How can a mayor of a rural municipality have 14 bodyguards? Deputy mayor, 8. Speaker, 9. And then what's going to happen to the money that we could budget and hire a security to go and look after our clinics as we open them 24-7. We hire bodyguards to look after the most useless people. I mean, there is a, a, a comrade there we grew up with her in the youth league called Stella Davin. They now call her Stella Abrams. She's a minister of small business with bodyguards. Why would you want to kill a minister of small business? <laughs> oh, minister must pass a shop. What did she deny you? Did she refuse you a spaza shop? There are lots of people like her, including deputy ministers, that without bodyguard, you won't even notice that this is a deputy minister. 
Now, when you see people moving differently, only then you pay attention. Hey, what's happening? But no, deputy minister, which one? <laughs> Abel, even me, where I am now, in my position, there are certain deputy ministers I don't know. I get shocked. Huh? Even this one. Bodyguards are hired for status, for glory, not even for power. Those 14 bodyguards are given to a mayor by the municipal manager who's corrupt because the mayor must feel like the municipal manager, con municipal manager likes me. Can't the municipal manager realize you like things, give you the things you like, and take all the power to themselves. So, where the EFF finds itself operating with the IFP, Vulamel, there's something wrong there. So, we must always mug two forces here. That's how powerful we are. We are competing with two people. The IFP this side, the ANC this side. And that must be very clear. I heard the deputy president saying, if given an opportunity, we must remove the district mayor of Zululand. We must remove, we don't want an opportunity. We must remove anything that is IFP, where we've got the power, we must remove them. You know why we're removing them? There's nothing they can do. They used to threaten people here yeah, and intimidate everyone. They will never do that with the EFF. They will never coerce our votes through intimidation and threats of violence. We will remove them. We have removed them anyway in many municipalities. We are seated with them in a meeting like this. And we said, let's do the following since we're working together. They said, no. We said, we're going to remove you. They said, ah, there's nothing like that. Ah. You know, these people are so good with puppetry. That puppet president of the IFP pretended like he's got some power. Ah. Ah. Even called a press conference the following day. Hey, we're not scared of Malema. Nongoma. Swashaya corner, Nongoma, where it matters the most for the IFP. Sbaishae, Babe in denial. We are born a little Lincoln's AFP, but to one he was in Parliament. What's the Nongo? Mwang. A balaga in a motto, the municipality Mwang. He could not believe it. He thought he was dreaming. Some shy. Sakala straight in Nongo. Saishae AFP. What about good to see Adala as Thinking they can intimidate us, we're not the ANC. We don't use we don't use violence. We use superior logic. We make calculated move. So shy slagging now. Sit down gun. Uzobuya one day as